We have every right to dream heroic dreams. Those who say that we're in a time when there are no heroes, they just don't know where to look. My father left before I was born. I was basically brought up by my grandparents. Mark's family had always had a weight problem, particularly his mom. In her effort to control her weight, she had become addicted to prescription diet pills. I can remember seeing her in the hospital and uh, having a lot of things uh, happen to her from, from drugs and what drugs can do to you. When I was 18 years old, she finally uh, died from a drug overdose. In search of a way to avoid the type of suffering his mom had gone through, Mark attended an herbal symposium conducted by the Republic of China. What he learned there convinced him that herbal nutrition could be the key to safe and effective weight loss. He then sought out the best manufacturer for his products. And from a small office in prestigious Beverly Hills that also served as the company's warehouse and distribution center, Mark made over $23,000 in his first month of business. Spreading the word about Herbalife through ads, flyers, and his business opportunity meetings on Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday, one of the first people to respond was Jerry Satanovich. This ad just popped out at me. It said, prisoner, are you tied to a desk? Do you hate punching a clock? And I looked at that ad. It was the, I, I tore it out. It was the only ad I tore out. It was the only ad I responded to. And that ad, Mark Hughes answered. Always looking for a way to increase sales, Mark's first promotion was a weekend getaway vacation to Palm Springs. Nine people qualified, and it pushed Mark's royalty check to over $2,000. By the end of its first year, Herbalife sales had reached an astounding $2 million, and the company moved to its new office and warehouse in Culver City. Quickly outgrowing that space, Mark had to acquire an additional warehouse just to accommodate the incredible amount of product being shipped. And on September 12th, Mark gave out the first production bonus award for $21,000. With sales of $10 million by the end of the year, Herbalife began its first international expansion into Canada, with Leslie Stanford leading the way. I remember one day we were just flying. We couldn't believe it. Our our royalty checks, my check, had gone from $2,000 to $8,400 to $19,500 in three consecutive months. There